Hello everybody, it's Andrew here again, author of 500 Social Media Marketing Tips. Check out the link in the description to grab your copy today. In this video, I'm going to show you a quick tip to help increase click-through rates to your website or blog on Pinterest. And really it's a lesson on why installing the Pinit bookmarklet is really the best way forward and to mostly avoid uploading pins directly from your computer. So let's get straight to it. Let's just imagine that I wanted to add another book to my ebook portfolio. What I could do and what a lot of people do is come to add, upload a pin and choose a file from their computer. In this instance it's my book How to Use Yelp for Business. I'll insert the description and the price and pin it and when people see it they've got the link to the product here but what a lot of people do particularly if they're just looking at it in this view is click on the pin and click again to try and go through to the website to buy it and of course we just get this crappy looking page which is just where the image is hosted on Pinterest what I really want to do instead is make the image clickable straight through to Amazon and to do that I come to edit and you'll see this link box paste the link in there to and save the pin and now when someone clicks on it here we are straight through to the Amazon page of course I could have saved all of this trouble by pinning the book using the pin it book mark look tool I'll just show you quickly with this example with my how to use Tumblr for business book if I click pin it and choose the correct image here we are the description is already there for me all I need to do is enter a price and perhaps a shortened URL to give a second way that viewers on Pinterest can click through and just pin it this way then when anyone sees it on my Pinterest account they can click through and it works straight away so there we are, just a quick tip to help you avoid the pitfalls of uploading a pin directly from your computer. You want to make sure that that clickable link is on the image and takes viewers straight through to your website or product. That's all for this time, I hope it helped. Don't forget to click subscribe for lots more social media marketing tips like this one. And to check out the link to my book in the description below. Thanks very much for watching and goodbye.